COVID is concerned and with this new surge in COVID cases now being spread to large parts of the country. Global record of new coronavirus cases for a fifth day running. The temple in Delhi is crowded with vehicles, full of sick and dying people. So far, only 1.5% of India's population has been fully inoculated. The capital is being ravaged at a frightening speed. Desperate people gasping for air. Nothing, nothing is being done. I don't know how much they see being a god there to die. I am not in any heartache. In the situation which I am seeing, the government is a literal failure. Of course, it cannot live. This small sister of the day is facing a daily struggle. We all know that India is going through a crisis right now and since no one is out there to help us, we are kind of on our own now. Right now everyone is dependent on their local workers, healthcare workers and suppliers. So yeah, it's a really, really overwhelming situation. So through this video I wanted to show the things we students can do to help other community. Because right now even though we're studying for the future, we can still make now a better place. I also wanted to share some tips and tricks for retaining motivation and staying focused these days. All these sources, even though I have looked over them once, they may or may not be still fake. So I urge you to go about this with extreme caution and please, please, please check everything before you sign any document, before you lend anyone money and all that stuff. Please be careful. I know this seems like a stupid tip but hear me out. When I turn my video on, I am forced to concentrate on the meeting. I can't relax in my chair and sit like this, this or this. I usually do this in the subjects I find the toughest or most boring. Even if no one else has the camera turned on, don't let that stop your focus. I get a lot of DMs about which books I use. I already have a video about this which should appear somewhere above here. But as a reminder, don't get tons of books at once. Focus on one book at a time. Otherwise you won't be able to retain anything. Practicing a single kick a thousand times rather than practicing a thousand types of kicks is always better. In lockdown, have one non-screen related hobby. Don't treat meals as your break time. You need a separate activity to focus your mind onto some other learning skill such as drawing, reading or even doing chores. This is a very common tip but many people don't follow it and believe in the toxic study for more than 10 hours a day mindset. For the sake of your mental health, please don't follow such toxic standards and go with your own methods. Stress has adverse effects on your body, like hair falling out, mood swings and muscle pains. Take 15 minutes out of your day before you study to stretch out and you'll feel a lot more relaxed before you study. I don't always do this, I'll admit, but I do it once every few days. I don't do this every day, I admit. <laughs> But I make sure to do it every once in a while because otherwise I get really bad. Uh, I don't do this every single day I admit but I try to make sure I do once in every few days to prevent my back from becoming a mangled mess of muscles.
अगर आपके पास एन मास्क नहीं है तो आप दो मास्क लगा सकते हो एक तो आम जो सर्जिकल मास्क है ट्रिपल एड सर्जिकल मास्क वो आप पहले अपने चेहरे पहले लगाएं और उसके ऊपर कपड़े का मास्क लगा सकते हो सो दैट वॉज टूडे इज वीडियो एंड आई होप यू एंजॉय इट एंड आई होप यू Uh, learned about these resources that you can use how you can help out stay focused and best of luck to everyone